Good morning everyone and welcome back to Fernfall Farm. Kylie got a new letter. So let's read it real quick and just to start the morning off. Alright, what's this say? Hmm. Handmade. Kylie, if I'm not too late, did you know you don't need anything but your two hands and a cutting board to make ice cream? I guess it's handmade in a sense. A bit obscure though. A distant friend. Who needs trouble? Oh my goodness! I can't believe that! Kylie, is it true? Have we really spent all this time not only expanding the kitchen and buying the super duper expensive blender and the super duper expensive blender recipes, only to turn around and find out that the ice cream recipe was within our grasp the entire time? Oh, oh my goodness. Well, let's, let's check. Okay, rice ball, pickled turnip, chestnut rice, pickles, cherry shashami, pickled eggplant, there's a lot of pickled stuff, trout shashami, bamboo rice, dye shashami, potato salad, ice cream. Oh. My gosh. It's been here the entire time, Kylie. All this time. All this time. The weeks we spent collecting enough money so that we could expand the kitchen, so that we could buy all the gear buy the recipe books and the ice cream has been sitting right under our nose the entire time. Oh wow. Oh, it's a good thing you had an anonymous friend write in about that. Uh, a dessert made from cooled milk. It tastes best as it melts in your mouth. Well, the good news is that we're finally able to make ice cream! Alright! The ice cream drama is finally over. Uh, let's see. You know, if we had milk. Alright, actually, it's almost time for a certain somebody to stop by, and it's a rainy day. Hmm, you know, the other day she mentioned that she likes fruit. Why don't we try giving her a cherry and see what happens? Put these away. Oh, it's a nice rainy day, so I suppose, Kylie, we're gonna work on gathering more cows. Or, excuse me, buffaloes. Hmm, she's not here yet, so let's peek. And that's going to involve expanding our grass tremendously. We're going to like pull it out, I think, all the way to the top. Maybe not all at once. That might be a little bit much. But do that. And then, because right now, we only have a couple buffaloes. Let's see, barn. There we are, barn. Yep, we have Mama and Sis. You guys haven't met Sis yet. We just got her last night. But she's like Mama. Uh, good buffamo. Not nearly as high a level. I wonder if that, like, their levels go up the longer you keep them. Hmm. I think they do, because Evening, whose who's name is spelled wrong. Evening. Even. Even. Oh dear. Well, that's supposed to be Evening. <laughs> evening, Noon, and Morning are different levels, with different HP amounts and different attacks. So that's pretty cool. The longer you keep an animal in your barn, the higher its level, attack, defense, magic, and HP seem to go up too. That's nifty! But yeah, we have Mama and Sis, but we need to expand the barn so that they've got more room. Maybe get like at least a couple more cows. Which means we need lots more fodder. Alright, she'll be here any second. No, she won't, because it's holiday, Kylie. Man, I feel silly now. Oh well. Alright, well, let's get this grass cut and then go check on our animals. Because if Mama, Sis is too new to give us any milk, but if Big Mama has milk to give us today, then there is a very, very good chance that we will be able to finally solve the drama of the demon who wants his ice cream. That'll be good news for Melody. I bet she started sweat bullets. We haven't exactly moved very quickly on this event. Poor Melody. I mean, the hot springs is her her livelihood, and this demon is just sitting on the hot springs. And oh, but ah, even if we were able to, it's a holiday, so we won't be able to go up to Well Island. Man, all these setbacks all the time. That's okay. <laughs> This is Fernfall Farm, so we always have more to do. Hi guys! Nope, it doesn't look like... Because the, the day the milk is ready is the same day that the woolies are ready to be sheared. Aww. You know, let's take... Why don't we take Jake out today? Bring him with us. 
He's our newest, one of our newest additions. Big, or Sis, Little Sis, that's her full name, is actually the newest addition to our barn. Hi, honey. Hmm. Yeah, I think we'll be okay adding a few more. It doesn't take long to take care of our, our animals. And a whole family of the cows will help us actually be able to take care of things. There we go. Well, let's check just to make sure that we can't gather any milk. Nope. Sis, you don't happen to... Nope. Alright. So it looks like today is just going to be expanding the fields, guys. If we have more... Do we have more fodder? Yeah, we've got plenty of fodder. Alright, Jack. Oops. Alright, Jack, why don't you come with us? There we go. And he's just going to tag along. That's so cool. It's a holiday, Jack, so really we should be resting. But there's no rest for hard-working farmers like Kylie. Yes. Especially because the Roonies keep tossing yes. tree trunks and giant Ooh. boulders into our farm. Yes. Hmm. Maybe that's something we should do today. We should, like, try- whoops! We should maybe spend some time balancing the Roonies. Or at least checking to see how they're doing. Is that so, Jack? Hmm. I wonder what his attack would be. Jack, do you want to try to help us defeat the Lava Rats, boy? That would be really cool! Almost there. There we go. Got quite a bit cleared out. Oh, good boy, Jack. I wonder if we can give him treats. We should try catching a fish in a second and try giving it to him. Yeah, we've got 212 lumber. That's tons! That's plenty to go talk to Cross. Jack, let's see if we can feed you a fish. I'm gonna catch a fish, and we're gonna see if we can give it to you. That would be really cool. Aw, it's like we have our own puppy! There we go. Would you like it, Jack? Oh, no, he doesn't take it. Alright, that's fine. Kylie, I can't believe you're already tired. <laughs> Let's go inside and make some of our famous jam. But after that, it's going to be a busy day. We'll go check on loot. Uh, see if there's anything new that we want to be buying from him. Hey, Snapper makes fish soup, huh? Hmm. I have to think about that. Look at the kitchen. Oh, this kitchen. This is just amazing. I love this kitchen. Oh, we've just... I just love adding to the house and expanding everything. There we go. Well, let's go see if loot has anything we want. Ooh, actually... Eunice is over that way. Come on, Jack, we're gonna go into the green ruins, take care of the farms down there. And gather up those flowers, finally. Because Eunice is such a sweetheart. Oh, Jack seems happy, I'm so glad. He's having a good time with us. Alright, watch out, Jack. Aw, oh, man, what wolf? That can't smell good. Kylie, you missed. There we go. Come on, the water's right there. It, this must be really cool water, because it's got so much moss and it's just so clean. Let's come up here. Jack, don't eat this. Jack, no! Jack, squirrels! Ugh. Dogs and squirrels, I should have known. And he didn't even drop anything. Come on, Jack, this way. You can, like, harass the ants, I suppose. Yeah, he actually is harassing the ants. <laughs> Man, look at him take everybody out! Jeez, what a tough little guy. Alright. We can finally gather up flowers and start giving flowers away to everybody. Let's go ahead and pick all these moon drops. Because we are awesome. Isn't it just awesome how we finally started clearing out the green ruins, guys? 
bringing a little bit of civilization to such a wild area. Or even civilizing the wildlife, isn't that right, Jack? Woof! Oh, he says. There we go. Oh. All right, we'll get more flowers to plant there soon. Ooh, that was a deep growl. He doesn't like mess around. Wow, two for one. Good dog. And bam. No silver. All right, a little bit of rice. Oh good, you teleported with us. I didn't think about that till after we started like moving about. Let's see. Jack might actually really be more help in the lava ruins. I'm really tempted to take him with us now. What do you say, boy? We get beat the crap up every time we go in there, but you could be really helpful. Hmm. I don't know if we should go in there until we have the ability to get a stronger weapon, though. I'm thinking Kylie might need a sword or something, like a one-handed sword for speed. Specifically designed, of course, to work inside of the lava ruins. Alright, let's grab... We're gonna have to see... Ooh, maybe we can buy an oven from Loot today! Because we only have a million things of flour, it would be nice to actually be able to cook something with it. Alright, good boy, Jack. See, that wasn't so bad. We should get more... Oh, we should save up. At one point, in the future, so this is a future project, don't worry. Not getting sidetracked from trying to defeat the lava ruins, guys. Just thinking about a future project, it would be really cool to get some of those super rare, takes forever to grow flowers and stick them right in the like green green ruins mhm mm all right let's see you think selfie's home we have to have a word with her you think if she's read everything she would have told us the ice cream is one of the basic recipes nah she's not home oh i guess jack had to oh hey she is hey selfie you seem so lively so early mm, um She's concentrating. I should leave her alone. I guess. Still, I worry about her health. She reads so much, and she always seems so hungry. Hmm. Well, we'll come back to give her a rice ball in a while. Oh, good boy, Jack. Good boy, wait for me. Alright, let's come over here. Melody won't be ready. But let's see what loot's brought us today. Good! Jack seems very happy. I wonder if it makes him more cheerful to bring the animals out like this. How you doing today, Loot? Good morning. The rain's really pouring down. Yeah, does that hat, like, help you keep it out? Because it's a really fancy hat. <laughs> Don't you think summer is a dangerous season? Dangerous? Why is that? Because I'm traveling in this heat. Well, does the rain help at all? In this heat, the monsters will come inside my canteen. Oh, like to get away from the, the heat? Uh, really? Yeah, monsters don't like the heat either. You should be careful too, Kylie. Oh, thanks for the warning, Loot. Um, do we have anything to give you? Why don't we give you a flower? You're an artist. Would you like a flower, sir? Here you are. Uh, he seemed to like it well enough. Don't crowd me too much, Jake. There we go. Alright, Loot, what do you have to sell? Hmm. Makers? Yogurt maker? Seed maker? <gasps> cheese maker. Oh, well, with all of the milk we hopefully will be having soon, the yogurt and cheese maker could be really useful. We could really go all out. Instead of being Fernfall Farm, it could become Fernfall Dairy. Hmm. I wonder how much the cheese and yogurt sell for. What else? What are some other options, sir? Furniture. Ooh, a giant fridge. That's so tempting, but we don't have enough money for it. A large table, relaxation curtain. We don't have too many friends over for dinner right now, so that's probably okay. Um, let's see. Legendary frying pan, great pot, handy steamer. 
I think we're good on that. I would really love an Ooh. oven, sir. You don't happen to have an oven. I want to make some flour, you know, into bread. Mm, I have butter that I made accidentally, so already good there. Mm, the chef's kitchen, Maestro's Forge, Great lab Laboratory. Mm, chef's kitchen. The Great Laboratory. Those are both very tempting. And then storage for the areas, too. Oh man, why is it that I want to blow all of our money, all of our hard-earned money, all of a sudden, on a chef's kitchen? That That's ridiculous. But I, I think I am going to pick up the cheese yogurt makers. Let's see. Because we don't have them yet, but we're planning on getting more animals. And you only show up here, like, once a week, sir. We would also like to buy... This is it. Mm-hmm. Alrighty. Oh. Yep, we're gonna do that. We're investing. We've put the money down. We've committed. Fernfall Farm is adding a dairy. Oh yeah. We should see Cross next. See how much he wants. Ooh, is she open today? Rosetta. Oh, oh. oh good boy, Jake. Or Jack. Why do I keep calling you Jake? Jack, stay outside. Let's see. Rosetta. Nope. I wonder where she ran off to. I mean, it's a rainy day. Let's see, and where's Eunice? She probably can't put the laundry... Nope, laundry's not out today because it's raining. So let's go inside. By the way, we haven't seen that... Oh, hey, Eunice! <laughs> Still wearing the hat even though you're inside, huh? Hello, Kylie. Hi, love sweets. Yes, but I hear rumor has it that you also love flowers. We grew this for you. We meant to bring it out of the dungeon ages ago. I'm sorry about that. Wow, thank you. I'll be sure to cherish this flower. You're welcome, Eunice. What do you think of this village? I love how quiet this village is. Kylie, I hope you will like it too. Thank you, Eunice. I think she's so much happier now that more people have started to move in. Can you imagine growing up here? Like, with nobody else to hang out with? Anybody? Oh, hey, Rita! A little awkward, just running into your bedroom to talk with you. Nobody around here. Hi. Yeah, it is pretty hot. I don't feel like passing out myself, though. Oh, goodness. Let's get out of here. I feel like Kylie could get himself in a lot of trouble if he, he's alone with her too long. Yeah, no, those doors are still closed. Have you seen a strange girl walk by? Ganesh is really good at what she does. But she won't even sharpen your kitchen knife if you don't take her the materials to her. And that's why if you have any extra, can you give them to me? Like iron, copper, and silver? Thanks. Wait, you like iron, copper, and silver? Um, I have some silver, but I don't want to share <laughs> my silver. So here you go, have some copper. Oh, wow, this is for me? Now I can get Ganesha to make me the best kind of kitchen knife. Oh, wow. Well, that made him really happy. We learned something new. That's so fun. We learned that Turner loves having, like, scrap metals and metals given to him, just like Ganesha does. Speaking of which, I've got more. Oh, but she's not here. Where does everybody go on holiday? I swear. Do they go out of the village? Do they travel to another village? See, nobody's home. Nobody's home anywhere. They just abandon us. They, they just leave town. Trampley Village becomes a ghost town on holidays. I'm so glad you're here at least, Jake. Jack, Jack, why do I keep calling you Jake? Oh my goodness. It's because I had a dog named Jake once, that's why. At least we have our loyal new wolf. Alright. I guess we'll just focus on the task at hand. See if Cross is here. I bet he's over at the church, though. Oh, no, Cross, you're home! I'm so glad you're home, Cross. How are you doing? It is terrible. I feel like I'm going insane. Do you really like winter then? It's summer. I don't have a lot of good memories when it comes to summer. <sighs> the sticky humidity, attacking monsters. That year was certainly hell for me. Oh wow, that's pretty extreme, Cross. I'm so sorry to hear that things were that rough. Here, we have one of your favorite warrior medals. I hope that'll help. You seem to have gotten much stronger. Be careful not to get injured severely. Thank you, Cross. Man, things must have been really rough with him. <sighs> well, that's that. Hmm. 
Okay. Jake. Jack. Jack, you stay here. I don't think that Bianca would appreciate having a wolf in her house. But I haven't seen her in a while either. But this place is so big. Trampoline Village is a ghost town on holidays. Hmm. Nobody here? Man. <laughs> this place is so big! Cross must have, like, had some outsourcing help to get it built. It's just huge. Oh, hey! Tabitha! Monsters attack humans so they are hated, but they have adorable eyes when you look at them carefully. Oh, I think you I and Cross would get along well. I with monsters if you deal with them with lots of love. Yes, we do that frequently with this pet glove, and even though they tend to break ribs like Big Mama, things get through. We've got quite a few on our farm, actually. Oh, that reminds me! We totally forgot to talk to Cross about expanding the farm. We're passing out flowers today. Would you like one? Here Thank you go. Thank you very much. I can't tell if that made you happy or not. It's always so confusing. Yeah, I don't think her... Oh, there she is! It's the Bianca girl. Drinking some, some yeah. hot chocolate, it looks like. Hello. Do you know of anything interesting to do? You can come and help us muck out the barn. Personally, I find that fascinating. But we hear you're having a hard time adjusting. So we brought over this azure brooch. Made it just for you. Hope you like it. Your taste haven't changed, it seems. I guess I'll put it on, since you tried. Ah. <sighs> Nope, she didn't like the mixture of rare gemstones and silver either. At least we tried. We're being good neighbors. Alright, just gonna check with Cross. Really quickly. To see what it will take to expand our barn. So that we can have our dairy. Let's see, whoops. Um, sorry about that. I meant to ask you, how much uh, you would it would it take if you would use, um, well, we have a barn, but to expand our barn is going to be 300 lumber and 18,000 gold. Well, we're a little short on that. Um, we'll be back to that cross. It looks like the Fernfall Farm Dairy might have some minor setbacks. Might take a little while to get to, but that's okay. That's okay. We've got some goals to work towards again. Isn't that awesome? And eventually we'll get that ice cream. <sighs> oh, come on, you can, you can do it. Good boy. Alright, we're going to clear out this bit of the field. And get some of those seeds planted. And then maybe, you know, later... Later, Jack and I, and Kylie, Ooh. and you, we can all go into the lava ruins and see if he can be a good help at being able to get in there Ooh. and really clearing out some of the monsters. So that'll be for later. For now, we're going to get to work on trying to plant the grass on all this spot so we can eventually, eventually get ice cream. We're getting there. We're one step closer. <laughs> all right, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye. Hello, everyone. Ever wanted to write a letter to Kylie and spice up his days on Fernfall Farm? Well, guess what? Now you can! Just follow the links in the video description below to send a short note his way. Annette will be sure that your letter finds its way to Kylie as soon as possible. You could write in recommendations for recipes, questions for Kylie about his favorite food or constellation, or of course his favorite girl. You could talk about your favorite girl in Trampoli Village, talk about the farm, maybe drop a little advice for a hard-working farmer. Just remember, no spoilers, please. Keep advice short and sweet. Miss loves those who work by the sweat of their brow and earn what they get, after all. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.